the NAFS lander in D2. I had a bunch of customers requesting me to make scales for this knife, so I did. Uh, short review of the knife. Thing's got great action. It's on bearings, D2 steel. I'm a sucker for a black coated blade. This is like black stone wash, looks beautiful. Really nice action, really sharp. Um, the only thing I think could be improved is it's kind of hard to get that thumb stud. Which I think I fixed that in my scales, which I'll show you guys here in a little bit. You know a real knife guy designed this knife. Because most people, when they get a knife, they're going to customize it. And this knife is super easy to swap out the scales. You don't even have to unscrew the pivot. All you do is take out the handle screws and the pocket clip and the filler tab, and they slide off. The knife functions without scales. I think that's a great design. I'm not sure offhand how many other knife models do that, but I think that's a great idea and feature to put in your knife. So uh, let me take these off, put uh, my scales on. So here's my scales. This is burgundy canvas, black burlap inlay. Here's the finger choil I cut in. Makes getting that thumb stud so much easier. This knife flies open on those bearings. Almost feels like it's spring assisted, but it's not. When you're on the website and you order scales for this knife, it's gonna give you the option of right hand tip up or both. Um, I can't remove that from this model. It's, it's a royal pain to do anything on that website. But no matter if you order both or right hand tip up, it will be both. It'll be cut out for both sides tip up because uh, this filler tab is uh, required to hold down scales from the manufacturer. As always, you can see, I put all the handle screws in the base material and not the inlay. Uh, for this burlap, as strong as the outside, really wouldn't matter in this material, but when you go into Mexican blankets, stuff like that, that's when it really matters. But you got a little pop of color around it. So if you're interested in uh, some scales for this knife, my link to my website will be in the description box below. Catch you on the next one.